work very late hours, Mr. Queen. Putting killing back on the table is a huge step backwards. That's not what she would have wanted. The dead don't want anything. If you hit me again, I'm gonna kill you. that these murders might be the works of a different vigilante. It's just me out there. I can't do it alone. I'm recruiting a new team. They're already out there, Oliver. Because of you. Inspired by you. I'm Curtis. Evelyn Sharp. So wait, there's training? Get past me. Ring that bell. So we're playing games now? Central on the CW. What's up, YouTube? So, we've got a brand new Arrow trailer, as promised by Stephen and Mel, released on his Facebook page. So, it looks really, really cool. It looks like season five is going to be incredibly action orientated. And we have some brand new reveals of new things coming to this season and characters. Revealed, which we haven't actually seen much of before, such as Cody Rhodes' character and also Prometheus. Now we see Taya mention the dead. Obviously, this is the people who passed away in the last season. Obviously, Laurel Lance. And she's hitting his feels because he's gone badass again. He's gone season one arrow. Because you know what? He's lost a lot. And you know what? He is sick of having to put up with being a perceived good guy so I'm glad we're getting back the arrow of old because it was a lot better so here we can see the street level villain who will cause a lot of trouble for Oliver Queen and the brand new Team Arrow 2.0 throughout this season so we've probably got two main villains here we've got this street level one, and of course we've got Prometheus shown at the end of the trailer, so it's not going to be easy for Team Arrow. So this will be the main guy, and they try to bring down his operation, all the while that Prometheus is the one who wants to take him the fuck out. So we can see here that Cody Rhodes is pretty much coming back from the dead. Now, it's got some weird kind of stuff going through his veins here, which looks very, very strange, to say the least. So, it could be some kind of MacGuffin that has been used in the DC Universe, and it looks like there will be rabid muscle-bound zombies facing off against Team Arrow, not to mention the other two villains as well. So, it seems like Cody Rhodes is playing quite a big role in this I, for one, love it because I'm a huge fan. Now, considering that it has been five years of seasons, we've also had five years, or going to have five years, of flashbacks. Now, we know they spent five years away, and they came back five years later. So, we also know about the Bratva, so it seems like this flashback is going to play a huge role in the making of the current age Oliver Queen which is going to be really, really cool to see him have his initiations, and I hope it's more interesting 
then lol, he's going back to the island again that was last season's flashbacks. So I think I'm a lot positive for this season, especially these flashbacks, because they do look exciting, especially because it's got a certain actual Dolph Lundgren. Now, obviously, we've got Dolph Lundgren, who is going to be a big, big problem for past Oliver Queen here. And he is playing a Russian mob boss who obviously had a lot of ties to the family of the people he said he was going to avenge last season in the flashbacks on the island. So expect Dolph Lundgren versus Oliver Queen at some point. And I will break you things to happen. Now we know from the previews of this season that Prometheus is something from Oliver Queen's past. So people think it is Tommy Merlin. I think it's going to be Tommy Merlin. So that's going to be really interesting to see who this reveal is. And now from this trailer we can gather the fact that he has the sights set for Oliver Queen and only Oliver Queen. So it's bad times for Oliver Queen this season because he's mayor, lover to a Felicity, and also mentor to Team Arrow 2.0. So the first half of this season I think will be a lot of training for Team Arrow 2.0. And you can see Diggle there even though he actually left, which is very, very odd. But that's it for this video. Please do drop a like. Please do subscribe for more of the similar content. Comment below what do you think. And I may have a flash video up later tonight. I'll see you soon and goodbye.